Nicole. And a true. And, and this, this is Royal, Royal Weekend, Weekend Review. Review. Today is November 16th. Do you hear about the Quiet Concert? I did, but I don't really know anything about it. Here's some information about it. What is Lovesick? Lovesick is a play showing today and tomorrow. You should definitely go, sis. Well, you heard it from Siri. You guys should go today and, and tomorrow. tomorrow. We should probably be done inside. Okay. Um, well, I, I already told you I, I can't do some of those things yet. I take things slow. I know, and I totally respected that, but this is just too slow. I mean, we've been together over a month now, and I've never been over to your place, and you've never been over to mine, and I never even held your hand, and I thought it was getting kind of weird. Movies, I don't love you, I don't need you, and right now I'm gonna leave from beside you. I don't want ya, I don't need ya, I'm not down for you always. <laughs> Hello, Royals. Today is a very special occasion. Recently, a Royal staff member has reached out to us and shared a very tragic personal story. Ms. Barry sent out an all-staff email asking, what should students do if they lose their ID cards? While this may seem like an easy question to answer, one staff member decided to give a rather personal response. From Mr. Christensen, Ms. Barry, I have a quick question. I was wondering about ID cards. When I was in elementary school, I had a teacher, Mr. Langbush, and he married Ms. Martinez. I had Mr. Langbush for fourth grade, and he was a great teacher. He later went on to buy the Somerset Community Pool, where I was a brief member. It was hard for us to maintain our membership, even though I love swimming at the pool every summer. Miss Martinez was my third grade teacher. She was a total jerk. But she used to give away pencils for good spellers. I never got a pencil until the end of the year, and the last week she found out I never received a pencil. I was the only student in the class that didn't get a pencil, so she gave me a pity pencil. Well, they got married in the fifth grade, and Miss Hazlip was my teacher. In the fifth grade, I was playing on the playground stump, which you were not supposed to do, and I fell playing king of the stump, and I hurt my leg. I didn't tell anyone because I knew I was not supposed to play on the stump. Today, that leg hurts. Should I tell Miss Hayslip? Today, we are going to be answering your question, Mr. Christensen. We have tracked down a very special guest. Hello, this is Mrs. Hayslip, and I'm here to discuss some unresolved playground issues that I understand you have, Mike, and I'm here to help you with that. Look forward to seeing you. Let's go. Yeah, to mine. Leave. Oh, jeez. Hey. Mrs. Hazel. Mr. Mr. Christensen was in my class in fifth grade. And there seems to have been an issue that's come up about his playground behavior on fifth, at fifth grade. And so I came down here to try to get that resolved. There was a big stump on the playground at Somerset Elementary when he was there. And he was out playing out there and he was injured, but he wasn't supposed to be playing there. And so he didn't want to tell anybody and get in trouble. And so I'm here after all these years. I was going through my, the elementary yearbook, fifth grade, and I thought, I really need to see if you're doing okay and if you feel all right about it now. Or you can they tell They really me. went to this extent, didn't they? <laughs> wow. I am impressed with that. Yeah, yeah I'm okay. I'm, I'm good, thanks. Yeah. I'm good. yeah. How's your leg? Good? Yeah. It's, it's, it's better. It's better. I appreciate it. Yeah, it's healed slightly since fifth grade. Just a little bit. It's got a little bit of a, like, kind of a twitch in it on rainy days. But it's, it's okay. See, you recently hurt your arm. Is that also from the stuff? It, yeah, it was uh, it was a little bit of a carryover from that, but totally different. Yeah, totally different. Yeah. <laughs> look, look how cute I was. Look at it. it's a very poor quality. <laughs> yeah. He was very cute, and he was 
very well behaved and very nice. And I think I had your sister as well. Yeah, she, Mrs. Yeah. Hazel taught all of, all of the Christians and children. And yes. I was the best, I will tell you. Yeah, yeah. are you sure about that? 100% sure. <laughs> just so you know, I will get them back. I will, I will get them back, just so you know. Thank you. And that's it for this week's episode of Royal Secret Review. I'm Nicole. And I'm Truth. See, See you, you next, next week. week. Bye. Nicole. And Truth. <laughs> and it's true. <laughs> New teacher challenge. I don't even know what it's about. <laughs> I don't know what it's about. I don't even know what it is. Oh, 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 oh. You do it and then. Okay, okay. Okay, I'll do it. You're professionals here. <gasps>